Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to another episode of our Pokemon White Randomized Unlock with me, your main man, Tommy Lou. I hope you're well, I hope you're happy, and of course, I hope you're loving life. How are you doing today? Leave that down in the comments. How are you feeling? It has been quite a while. I think it's been about a week since I did a load of recording for this game, which means I, I need to do a team recap for myself. I hope you've been enjoying the series so far. Of course, we did a big bulk recording thing to make sure I was prepared for Cyberpunk coming out. And in the end, I decided to not really stream Cyberpunk. We did, like, quite a few streams of it, but then I just sort of slowed it down. Because I think a lot of people were so determined to play it themselves, uh, they weren't that interested in the streams. Which is totally cool, I understand that. I'm just explaining why I did the bulk recording again. So we have got Adamant, Jeffrey. Jeffrey, you're so damn adamant. But look at him, he is a big musky, 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 that, that does not mean muscular, that means like there's a weird smell about them. Jeffrey might be musky, but he is certainly muscular, and he is lifting his weights, he's a Conkelder, no items, of course, we don't have the use of items yet, he's got the ability synchronized, wake up slap, rock throw, low kick, focus energy, amazing mon, amazing addition to the team. We have got B -B -B Baker the Shaman. Not like our, uh, not like our Baker Burnasaur in our Ultra Red uh, Nuzlocke that we are live streaming at the moment. If you haven't checked that out, be sure to do that. The forms in that game are insane. Like every Pokemon you know has been reworked, redesigned, retyped. It's freaking awesome. Shaman level 23, Magical Leaf, Growth, and Leech Seed. And then finally, we have got Dragonite, the Dragonite. Oh, oh the name rater is in this town. We can, we can try and find the name rater. Dragon flying type, Twister, Thunder Wave, Dragon Rage, and Slam. He's got Insomnia for his ability. Um, not a great ability. No, sorry. Not a great nature. But we're going to work on sorting that out. Now, it looks like... Oh, I think it's just early morning. Because it's... It's 10... It's 10 a.m. here. I've got a few things... Why can I not? I can go in. So... Oh, it's this building. This this is a good building to go into. People who work in this building have Pokemon battles, not opinion battles. You appear to be strong, but if you go upstairs, please be extra careful. So, we could well lose the Nuzlocke here. I don't know, because we can get a few encounters. We can't go to the sewers, can we? That's black and white too. But we want to do this. It's really good for training. And he gives you the EXP share if you beat everyone in here. And I can't really remember what levels they are, but I think we're in a good space. Of course, everyone's going to be boosted by 10%. We know this. We know this. And of course, we are coming up. I think I'm only going to record the one episode today because I have a lot to do today. I've got like real life things to do, which is boring, I know. But they have to be done. And because uh, I need to drive up about two hours away, but I need to go to my new workplace. I start work in the new year. Uh, Kingston Trust Hospital. Yo. Um, pro plays by Scruffy. Um, I need to go up there. And basically, uh, I need to do an, what's called an ID check. So I need to take my driver's license, my passport, and a bank statement just to confirm I am, in fact, who I say I am. Because people don't want to be catfished. Not for dates, not for jobs. Will we get a gym battle done in this episode? I don't know. It's more likely to be next episode. Um, actually, then again, we just, it just depends if we want... This is an Entei, by the way. It just depends if we want to go north. Because we can get encounters. Okay, we're actually going to go for a rock throw because that's going to be super effective. And we are adamant. It's going to do a hell of a lot of damage. How much will you do? Uh, about half. Okay, well, now now we go for a wake-up slap. We're going to slap this Entei. Slap you real good. I'm going to try and not speed up for a change. I'm. We all know that I'm a bit happy on the speed up. I don't know. It, I, I feel it, it's often it's often worthy of a bit of speed up. Chip, what's chip away? It's a normal type. Seven looks for an opening. The user strikes continually. The target's stat changes don't affect. Interesting. Yeah. 
I'm tempted to get rid of low kick. But I'm not. I'm not going to learn chip away. I'm going to keep our old moves. I don't think that's the type of move that's really going to improve us. Like, sure, if something uses Harden, like, or Iron Defense or stuff, yeah, it's going to be useful. But apart from that, I just can't see it being a major thing for us. We're, we're not going to run back to the Pokemon Center. We're just going to Super Potion up. And we will speed up for that bit. Uh, let's... There's a chair in the way. That's why we can't fight you. We'll fight you instead. Hee <laughs> hee, I'm better at Pokemon battles than I am at work. You should not be promoting that. You should either give up your job and become a Pokemon trainer, or you should just keep your fat mouth shut. Sorry, that got really aggressive really quick. Anyway, we're going to slap this float soul. Everyone's getting slapped today. We're, we're, it's like we're Burno out here, just giving out the slaps. Boom! That's a no-go. Oh, that might be really loud. I'm not sure. Who knows? Who cares? Jeffrey is gaining levels like he just doesn't care. We, um... Will we swap out? Uh... Yeah, go on then. Dragonite can come in. We haven't... We've only seen Jeffrey this episode. Jeffrey's now our highest level. So, we will get Jag... And, uh, there you go. <laughs> I'm, I'm a mentalist. So, what do I want? Um... And what, what do we get from this gym badge? Oh, we get a fourth member on the team! Yo, maybe we should try and push for the badge. Because if we get that badge, we will be... We'll get four members on the team. We can bring Lick back and... I know, Lewis, I read your comment on episode six. He's sad that uh, Lickitung has been benched. But dude, you've got to understand. Jeffrey is a small boy. And this is Akira, if you haven't figured that out already. We are going... How heavy do you reckon Akira is? I'm going to go ahead and say Akira's pretty damn heavy. So this is the reason I kept low kick. Because if you come across something like a Registeel or a large Pokemon... It will, it, it will act, I think low kick can go to like 120 base or something, so that's why we kept low kick, so it will be more than wake up stab. And I'm sorry, why are you leveling up so quickly? Have you got like a built-in lucky egg? Alright, well we're going to put, um, we'll put Baker out front. As Baker the Shaman cannot be overlooked. Oh, I would love to get the item, what is it, the Gracious Herb? Transform Baker into a Sky Baker. Skyform would be G -G -G Gaugus. And this is not a great type matchup for us. We go into Dragonite. And then the main badge I want, I think, I always think one of the most important gym badges in an unlock is the fourth badge, the halfway point, because that's when you can get the use of TMs. Oh boy! Oh boy! Can I not wait for the use of TMs? We've got some good TMs, and if we can get like Dragon Claw or Dragon Dance, because Dragonite again, his learn set's never been particularly good. The thing is, well, he learns more moves in this generation, but it's just so much later in the game. Um, getting them early would be being able to get those moves in the TM earlier, and him learning them 20 levels better would just make him such a better Pokemon. No shit, that's not... Super Sonic would be better than that, Ariados. Shout out to Ariados gang, new subscriber. Woo! Uh, David Thomas just sent me a WhatsApp, called me a naughty little bitch. I uh, don't know how to feel about that. <laughs> it's, uh, you, 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 gotta, you gotta love your friends. You, got, you gotta love your friends, even when they call you a naughty little bitch. Do we want to learn agility? I'm gonna consider it. I have considered it, and I have decided it's, uh, we're going to keep our old move. Um, I strongly consider, I'm going to move my phone away in case it's buzzing into the mic. Um, I strongly considered it. The reason I didn't learn agility is because, it ain't that good. <laughs> no, but, um, Slam, as much as I hate the fact it misses a lot, um, 
it, we are, it, it can, if we need to dish out uh, uh, some damage, if we need Dragonite to slam his tail into some fools, we know we can. So I'm speeding this up because Shuckle can be a bit of a hoe. Um, we are gonna, we are gonna get the kill though, with the Leech Seed. That was a big strap by me, I gotta say. Uh, you got, you gotta love the pro plays. Um, so we, we're making very short work of this office floor. Are you a trainer? Scope lens. Uh, you get some amazing items in this game. Um, of course, we we can't use the items, the held items, I should say, until the sick badge. This guy's just given us balls for days. Good feet. Thank you very much. All the balls. We are gonna. Wait, which floor was that? No. This one. We're gonna go to the top floor. There's the janitor. You think why is the janitor like? have a desk on the top floor of the office look you're asking too many questions you're already asking too many questions and you know what we spent 10 minutes and we're still battling these peeps i'm gonna speed this up now we're gonna leave seed on this mess bro oh in prison that's such a pro play it's really not because we don't have any of your moves um is that what in prison does I think it is, yeah. And uh, well, we could have just... Oh, we weren't going to two shot them. So once again, the Leech Seed proved to be a pro play. I'm a genius. There's really nothing else to it. I'm just an incredibly smart individual. Do you want to... Fennel regen? Do you want to fight me? You do. Del Caddy. You are a kitty caddy. And I don't know what to say. My voice has just been off key lately. It's been it's a bit upsetting for me. If, if you're into singing, you know when you're just missing the notes that you can normally hit. Ah, uh, it's a it's a it's a tough time. This is this is an easy body. Easy body. And we're gonna have two level 26 mobs. Bing. Baker's level 26. Now we're gonna get Dragonite up there. We've got a very nice, well-rounded team, and we're not having to like. We're not really having to stress anything, which I'm a big fan of. Wow, did you see how quickly we moved there? We went Super Saiyan for a second. We were like, Meow! I've actually never seen Dragon Ball Z. I'm sorry, I just assume Super Saiyan makes you go very fast. I've kind of seen like a little little bits of like what happens. I'm sorry for being a scrub lord and a, and a poser. <laughs> I'm sorry! I'm so I've just never seen it! It's just, it's just not something I've ever watched. Just, yeah. I should watch it. I've heard it's amazing, and it does look like the type of thing that I would love. Oh, drink that water, Tommy. Drink that water. Get it in your face. Get it in your face. Watch, Og. Yeah, we can take it. Come on, Dragonite. Oh, he's got the dragon. That's a pro play by the Watchog, for sure. Um, because, um, <laughs> I don't know. It's, it, it's, it's really bad ability, to be honest with you. For, for a Watchog. I mean, if, if he had a fire type on his team, or even something with, like, Chlorophyll, then. Sure. But he doesn't, so he's a bit of a. He's a bit of a goofy boy. Oh, you are the Pokemon trainer. I bet at the entrance you come this far. It means you must be quite strong. Are you prepared to be the strongest Pokemon in your building? The chairman? Oh, he's not the chairman. I remember... Oh, no, he is the chairman. I forget. He just dresses as the janitor to be like... Ha -ha! Performer Noel sent out the Monfer. Actually, I'm pretty sure that's how it works. Come on out, Dragonite. I guess this is like a mini boss battle, so I'll slow down again. Um, well, let's go for a slam. We taught the damn thing. Absolutely terrible. Absolutely, what a what a waste. What a gosh darn waste. And he got to the map punch. We resist that by like four times, you silly boy. Does Dragon resist fighting? I can't remember. I obviously obviously flying for this fight. Obviously. Dragonite's level 26. That's friggin' poggers, dude. I don't know. People keep saying pog and poggers to me. I've only recently learned what it means. At least I think it does. It, the, the point is, I'm 26. I'm getting to that horrible stage in life where well, if you, you go away from the internet, even for a couple of months, you come back and there's a new phrase and you're just, you're just far behind. He just gave us four and a bit K. That's amazing. I disguised myself as a janitor because I like to know what kinds of trainers can come here. I had a good time battling you. Take this. 
EXP share. Again, we can't use it, of course. Not until the sixth gym badge. Um, that's a long, long ways away. But we are gonna hop the hell out of here. And we're gonna we're gonna mosey on back to the Pokemon Center. No. I would love to rest, Nurse Joy. Thank you very much. You know what I'm gonna do? You know what I'm gonna do. I'm actually gonna rearrange the bag for a minute. I'm gonna put the super potions. For God's sake. I mean, okay, I like that we can do that, to be honest. Okay, we're gonna then, then, then we're good. Um, I don't think we need any more super potions. We'll keep Dragonite out as he is the starter, and then we're just gonna go around because we get. There's certain like TMs. There is a certain. There is a certain TM. I mean, okay, hang on. Is this the guy that he's gonna ask us to find his um troop? Is he not? Yo! It's um, it's Kinkle. He's about to get bodied by a Dragon Rage and followed up by a Twister. That's cool. Tech, you, you got me, buddy. So he's going to be like, hey, buddy, let's get down. And then he's going to do some spin. How about that smooth moves? Would you talk to the other dancers? And we'll say, yes, we will help you. And then we just got to find the rest of them. All right, so uh, here's one. Is there not a guy behind a dumpster that gives you a TM? Or is that in the next game as well? It's hard to keep up. Black and white one, black and white two. Apart from the very beginning of the game, they're like identical, so. Well, obviously they're not identical, but I mean like. Okay, no, so it's definitely not that way. Oh, here we go. Where did I put those glasses? Ah, I found them. And then he gives us. Because of course, he normally gives us like. I can't even remember. But he's given us stored power, which I'm honestly not sure how I feel. Um, one of the dancers is on the pier, is on a pier, I should say, not the pier, there's like four of them. Hey, here we go. Let's go! Yo, Black Vigoroths are broken. Download? And it downloaded all my days, that's insane. I would actually not mind a Vigoroth. We're gonna get Dragonite to like level 28. Okay, we can't go on a ferry. I pretty much expected so. No! Is this the this is the building we went in, right? The battle company, talent to train is welcome, yeah. So isn't there one more other like big building we can go in? Or am I losing my freaking mind right now? It's this one. I was almost certain the name rater was like here. I'm not doing your I'm not doing your quiz. No, I'm not doing your quiz. Oh, video games! No! Get out of my face. We out of here. So there's the gym, and I know if you go in the gym, then that activates the story. We're gonna go to the second floor. There's gotta be something going on. Oh, this, this is empty because this is where you come. Um, finish that sentence. Uh, this is where you come to fight Team Plasma. I believe. Because you go in the gym and then they're like, hey, you smell like poop. And then you fight them. Like, to that kind of thing. Oh, gotta be careful because again, if we go much further up, we're gonna get in a fight with like Sharon or something. Name Rater! Okay, fantastic. So we can train Dragonite to name. Um, so Dragovich. Someone suggested on the very first episode that we name is Dragovich. I know, Kalil, I know you want the Dragonite, but we'll find another bird for you. Um, Drago... Drago... I've, I've misspelled that. And you said with the... Uh, I think it might have been Luna. It was either Luna or Puns. Dragovich. But, and you put a H on the end, but I think it's more typical if we just put the C. Like it was a, a Slavic, a proper Slavic name. Uh, so we've got Dragovich on the team. Which I'm cool. I think that's a good name. 
Who are you? Do you want to go up? Yes. Okay. I'm not sure I've ever been up here before. Dancer. Huh. Have I... What's the point in this room? So she gave me teleport. Okay, that could have been really good for us. It, unfortunately, it wasn't. Because uh, teleport is an absolute booty move. I mean, we can sell it. Okay, guys. So I did a cut from after we got uh, after we changed the name of Dragonite. Now, the reason I did this is because I was being an absolute moron. I was looking for a third dancer, but of course, the third dancer is the one that stood right here. We've got all three of them, and we uh, the only other thing that happened is we went around and we got TMs. Um. Because uh, I was just going in every building. We got teleport. I can't remember if that was in. And we also, I literally just got given it. Um, skill swap. So we got two CMs that we'll probably never use anyway. Thanks, man. I've got the best team in the world here. That's how I feel. It gives us the amulet coin. Another great item that we can, unfortunately, never use. Anyway. Um, I'm going to shave three minutes off. That's probably how long it took. It probably wasn't even that long, but... I don't know, I was just running around in circles and I sort of stopped talking. So, ba -doom. Uh. Hey, Tommy. I just challenged Gym Leader Berg. He's a seasoned Gym Leader. He made me work hard for that Gym Badge, but for me, bug type Pokemon aren't much of a challenge. I'm going to keep winning like this against all of the Unova Gym Leaders. Then, I'll head for the Pokemon League and outperform the champion, if I do that. Everyone will admit what a strong trainer I am. That will make me feel truly alive. Sharon, you are a bit of a knob. Oh, no. Ha, 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 ha. You're the one who fought Team Plasma in Pinwheel Forest. If I remember, your name is Tommy. <laughs> Come to challenge the gym, I suppose. <laughs> oh, sorry, but could you wait a bit? I was informed that Team Plasma is showing up. In fact, come with me. I'm going to the dock at Prime Pier. His voice might be slightly different, but that's kind of what we had going on. Is this Prime Pier? No. Where is Prime Pit? Is it this one? No! Is it this one? Yes! Come on, this way! <laughs> He's kind of like Sharon, but a bit more upbeat. Team Plasma, they took this young lady's Pokemon. Tommy, is there anything we can do? My Muna, Team Plasma took it. I heard this lady scream and ran after the thief as fast as I could. But this city's so big and so crowded, I'm afraid I lost them. <laughs> Iris, you did everything you could. <laughs> but that's so bad. Taking people's Pokemon is really bad. Because it's really nice when people and Pokemon are together. They have, e they, they each have something the other doesn't, and they help each other. <gasps> Iris? Agreed. No fear, we will get that Pokemon back, right, Tommy? <laughs> Having said that, fighting a person or Pokemon here in Castalia will be like fighting a needle in a haystack. I spy a gym leader. <laughs> what the hell was that? Last time it went so well, I thought I'd grab another Pokemon. Rethinking, I need to get out of here. Part of Australia. In like a weird, non-Australian way. Tommy, let's go. Iris, you stay by that young lady's side. <laughs> Huh. I'm gonna be Bianca's bodyguard, so you go after those bad guys, okay? I'm kinda going for like... A young... Like, a young woman... Slightly gravelly voice, like... Not, not too feminine voice for Iris. I get the voice, she's quite a feisty character. Haha, <laughs> that way! <laughs> They're heading towards the gym? Oh, now he's panicking. Now Berg be panicking. Burger boy? Where's Ronald McJoker when you need him? Ha, ah, this is definitely the place. No one's here, not a soul. Maybe we should just make them all Australian. No other Team Plasma members, nor any of the Seven Sages are inside. If you think I'm lying, why don't we have a little battle and find out? <laughs> I had a thought. I'll take care of this weak-looking run, so you can show off by handling that tough-looking guy over there. Oh, please, Tommy, I'll leave that one to you. Okay, it's confirmed, Team Plasma. They're Australian. It's gonna happen. <laughs> the Seven Sages are gonna be Russian. The Getsis is just that, like, weird, like... And then, and then all the grunts will be Australian. I like the way this is going. This is a Gallade, and, uh, meet Dragon Ranger. 
I'm gonna speed this up. This isn't an important battle. This is very, very, uh... What's the word I'm looking for? Remedial? Is that the word? I don't think it is, actually. You're gonna send in a Duosion. We... We're not fast. We're gonna stay in and we're gonna Dragon Rage again. Hidden power! It's not very effective. You suck, Duosion. Duosion's actually quite good. Sorry. Nah. This is bad. Bad, 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 bad. Bad for team players, Marauder. Players bad for sure. It's the mo it's in my best interest to go report to the seven sages right now. <laughs> ah, funny. Phew, we got lost. Even with the directions from the cross transceiver, I couldn't figure it out. Haha, -ha, two plasmas. <laughs> I'm gonna have to do ha ha every time he talks. By the way, just to like get myself in the zone. The stolen Pokemon may be in there as well. Okay, I'm going in. Ha, huh, okay. This time I'll join the fight. Come on, Bianca, you two. Well, wait, Tommy, you come too. Bianca. Bianca's okay. She's a bit annoying. Bit annoying, Bianca. My word, if it isn't the gym leader, Berg. <coughs> Jesus Christ. Ha <laughs> ha! So what would you say is the guiding principle of Team Plasma anyway? <laughs> Take what you want from people? I thought it would be amusing to prepare a hideout right in front of the Pokemon Gym, but we would detect it more quickly than I imagined. Indeed. <sighs> no matter. We already have an exceptional base of operation. Is everyone familiar with the legend of the founding of Unova region? I am. It's the white dragon type Pokemon, right? The truth is, the White Dragon appeared before a hero who sought the true knight. True way to knit together a world full of many warring people. This White Dragon Pokemon shared its knowledge and bared its fangs, and those who stood against it. Together the power of the Pokemon and the hero brought unity to the hearts of everyone in the land, and that is how Unova was created. We shall bring back the hero again, and that Pokemon to Unova once again. If we can win people's hearts and minds, we can easily create the world that I, I, I mean, Team Plasma desires. Oh, he almost let his, his goal slip. Haha, <laughs> in here in Castelia, we have a lot of different kinds of people. Everyone's ways of thinking and lifestyles are different. Honestly, there's something about what you're saying I don't quite understand. One thing we all have in common is that we care a lot about Pokemon. Even people meeting for the first time can talk about Pokemon, talk about battle or trade. Remember your speech at Akumala Town? You were responsible for leading me to rethink my relationship with Pokemon. Haha, <laughs> for that I thank you. At that time, I made a promise. I swore to myself that I would dedicate myself to Pokemon even more strongly. What you guys are doing? Aren't you going to strengthen the bond between people and Pokemon even more? <laughs> you are quite hard to figure out. A little more intelligent than I'd expect. I am fond of intelligent people, you see. You'll be hearing about this from every corner of the world. I have gathered knowledgeable people for our king's benefit. You could call them the Seven Sages. Very well. We will submit to your opinion and be on our way. That girl over there? Return her Pokemon. Muna. Thank you. Muni, I'm so glad to see you again. Bianca. Why are you thanking them? These people, these people, they take people's precious Pokemon. It's just, I'm, I'm so happy that my Munna is safe. The friendship between Pokemon and people can be very touching. But in order to liberate Pokemon from foolish people, we will revive the legend of Unova and win the hearts and minds of everyone. Farewell. <laughs> what are you doing? Why are you letting them get away? Ha <laughs> ha! What do you, th <laughs> sorry. What do, <laughs> <laughs> what do we do if anything's happened to the other people's stolen Pokemon? It's okay. Thank you, Iris. No one was hurt more than anything when I got my darling Pokemon back. Okay, if you're happy. <laughs> what is everyone planning to do now? Oh, it would be sensational to look around Castellia City, but... <laughs> Don't worry. I'll be... I'll keep on your... being your bodyguard. Iris? <laughs> that's... Oh, um, that's great. Ha <laughs> ha! Iris is a dazzling Pokemon trainer, but maybe not at home in the big city yet. So, a little give and take, hmm? People and Pokemon need to help each other out. Ha! 
Also, thanks for looking for the Pokemon. Here, this is for you. A Yachi Berry. I mean, of all things you could have given me. See ya. What? Way! Ha <laughs> ha! Well then, Tommy, I'll be waiting in the gym. We are going to pick up this item. Oh my goodness me, what a little performance you just had. I hope you enjoyed the uh, the voice acting there. And with that, we're at the 33 minute mark, and minus the cut, that's going to be enough to wrap this episode up. So ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, if you did, in fact, enjoy this episode, if you liked what you saw, hit that like button nice and hard to let me know in a physical way. And of course, if you're not already, hit the subscribe button. What are you doing if you're not subscribed? Help me out. We're trying to hit 400 by the end of the year. It's going to be tough, but there is a chance, a slim, slim chance, but I cannot do it without you. Anyway, I'm going to get the hell out of here. I've been your main man, Tommy Lou, and I will see you in the next episode. Hee! Yeah! Tommy, Tommy Lou, Tommy Lou, Tommy, Tommy Lou, Tommy, Tommy Lou, now 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 now